Hey guys, it's me, Creature Monster 101, and today I'm going to show you how to fix the city of crashes. Now, give all the credit to iPod Touch Jailbreaker because I was looking for this for two hours and then I finally found this and it worked instantly. So don't forget to subscribe to him. And so basically, what you want to do is this is for when you open up Cydia and it'll start loading for about five seconds and then it'll just exit out. So if you have iFile on your phone, you want to open that up. Or you can SSH, and I have a video on that, which is also in the description. And on iFile, you want to go all the way back. And you want to do the same thing on on the SSH, which I use WinSCP. And then you would want to go to VAR, then lib, then apt, then list, and then there's going to be a whole list of 108 little repos from Cydia. And so you want to hit edit. Then you want to double tap, which will select everything. And then you want to tap partial again, which will unselect it. And then everything else will be selected except for partial. And make sure you don't delete partial because that's very important. And then when everything else is selected except for partial, you want to hit the little trash can, which will delete the 108 files. And when that's done, Cydia would now work. If that, if Cydia still doesn't work, you want to go back to lib and then tap on the DPKG and then go to updates and then there's going to be a couple of things in there. You can delete everything, but I read online to not delete the tmp.i file. I don't know why, but I just didn't delete it to be on the safe side. And then now, Cydia should work. And trust me, I'm not lying. I, I was looking for this for two hours, and it works. And it actually loads faster for some reason. So don't forget to subscribe to iPod Touch Jailbreaker. And I'll put his channel link in the description also. Give all the credit to him. And that's it. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. See you later, guys. Bye.